The mission of Navy Cyber Defense Operations Command is to enable power projection through proactive network defense. This is known as defensive cyber operations. In order to effectively protect, detect, and respond to cyber attacks on Navy networks, we must first understand what is happening on the networks. NCDOC maintains a secure computing environment, allowing the warfighter to safely complete their mission. One of the many ways NCDOC performs the DCO mission is through the use of the global sensor grid. It's comprised of intrusion prevention systems, intrusion detection systems, and host-based security systems. These sensors, which are installed worldwide on Navy networks, send data to NCDOC providing invaluable attack sense and warning information. NCDOC receives more than 28 million alerts per day. The vast amount of information and its complexity produces several challenges such as transfer, normalization, storage, search, analysis, and visualization of data. Without the right tools and a knowledgeable team, these challenges create the effect of drowning in data but starving for information. To overcome this, several departments, divisions, and personnel must work together. Sensor selection and deployment is the first challenge to receiving event data. Once sensors are chosen and configured, they must be deployed. Network connectivity is established through VPNs and firewall access control lists. Signatures are applied to detect potentially malicious traffic and activity on Navy networks. When suspicious activity is detected, the signature fires and generates event data. There are two types of signatures that NCDOC applies to the sensors. Vendor-based signatures, written by the product's professional teams, which are focused on public-facing threats. And custom, user-defined signatures, written by NCDOC's information security experts, that detect specific threats unique to the DoD information network. Once the data is available to the DCO team, analysts use in-depth knowledge to locate potential events or patterns of events to conduct the ASNW mission. This knowledge includes information about the adversary's activities, tactics, techniques, and procedures gathered through open source research and from our nation's 5 Eye partners. If an event is deemed to be normal network or host activity, then it's a false positive. To help reduce false positives, analysts submit the event data to the appropriate work center to update the detection mechanisms in the signature with a more specific TTP. However, if it is a true positive and the Navy might have a compromise on its network, mitigation and incident handling procedures are immediately engaged to counteract the threat. Forensics, malware analysis, incident response, and countermeasure development are just a few of the tools the NCDOC operations team employs to better respond to modern threats. Additionally, NCDOC has flyaway teams ready at a moment's notice to conduct event on-site analysis if the situation warrants it. In support of the Defensive Cyber Operations mission, NCDOC collects and analyzes data. This allows us to continually adapt our defensive operations to meet the changing tactics of our nation's adversaries. Using a diverse skill set, the NCDOC team works diligently to defend the Navy's networks, 